All right, quick thing before the video starts. Uh, my mic is cheap, so please don't bully me if you don't understand what I'm saying. So yeah. All right, I guess we're recording a video. And now I've been uploading since one and a half weeks, since a 5M video. Uh, yeah. I uh, only seen three people do this PC settings. PC settings, loadout, and uh, macros. Yeah. Okay. Uh, gamepad. Uh, which controller? Obviously, I use a PS4 controller. I show you how to get a uh, DS4. Uh, another video. But yeah, I play standard FPS too, just like in console. I'm a console player. Well, it came from console. Um. Bro, fuck. Okay. Um. These are my settings. Uh, I know Mop must put this all high, except Dead Zone. Put it all the way down. But I still feel like it's console, so I just play like this. Um, I still feel like a console when I like RPG spam or something like that, because I sometimes play like that when I'm on a when I have a controller for fun. Um. Raw input. I never messed with any of these key bindings. Uh, only thing I messed with was weapon select. Have that as my mouse four button on the side. Audio SFX. I turned on the music volume because that's kind of annoying. Auto scan for music. Kind of it gives you an FPS boost a little. I don't know how it does, but yeah, I have this on half because I run my discord chat on another computer so i always have like have like my airpod in like have my airpod in and I have my headset over it so yeah um okay these are the camera I, I need to go outside for these all right um all right camera uh first person ragdoll have this off actually no no we're gonna talk about camera ca camera height let me go to the v let me go to my night chart real, real quick um all right um so let me go to settings uh see how my camera height is on high if I put it low it's gonna look like that so you're basically ain't gonna see anything if you only if you do this with your mouse like you go down or with your analog stick if you push down but if you do where is it high you don't really need to do that because you can see the vehicles are up ahead of you all right next thing oh jeez it's rainy i wish i had a modder here so it'd be sunny as hell um first person uh a view it on foot hold up we go to there. Um. Okay, so this is your field of view, which is the highest. You can see like stuff right here, stuff right here. If you do this, notice how you can't see that building or anything o over here too. That's because this is all the way down. So you need the best possible field of view. There's an FOV mod, but I haven't used it. I haven't tried it yet, out yet. I'll try it out like a little bit later on. But yeah. First person ragdoll. Okay, I have. Uh, you're supposed to have this on on. But you know. They took out Evo and. You can't do it anymore. So what's the point? <laughs> I have it off. And also, if I get run over by a car and I see somebody coming up behind me or get to try to sh uh, shoot me out or something like that, I. Oh. Uh, by any chance and miss I just have this off but yeah uh first person combat roll is off because if you have this on Hi. fuck off brownie uh if you have this off you see how you can't see anything around you yeah and it's a little bit dizzy have this on where is it have it on uh you could 
Okay, what the hell? I turned on the wrong thing. STUPID! Okay, but for real, have it on. You can see your surroundings. Okay, what else should I explain? Uh, first person head bobbing. First person head bobbing. Okay, have it off, cause it makes me a little bit dizzy. And also, uh, your head doesn't move around that much, obviously. So yeah, have this on. You're gonna see. I can't do a side by side comparison right now because I really don't know how to edit that well. So yeah, have this on. Okay, now the rain is off finally, but have this on. You, you see like a little bit of movement around your head or something like that. That's because that's head bobbing. So I always have this off so it doesn't throw me off when I'm like running around or sniping. I don't know. But yeah, I have this off. First person, third person cover. Uh, I, I forgot how to take cover on PC, so I'm not going to get in depth on that. But yeah, you should know what that means. Uh, never mess with this. Oh, save some size. Uh, have this all the way up. And you really have to look for your enemies. Have this all the way off. And then you can spot your enemy really quick. I learned this from like PS4. But yeah, it just like makes it way easier. But yeah, graphics. I basically have Modmus graphics. Oh yeah, by the way, I'm going to put everything in the description below. That, um, uh, to help you guys out if you guys need, like, other opinions. Um, I have this on high because of thermal. Wait, I'm going to see my macros are on. Okay, my macros are not on. Let me switch out real quick. Alright. CEO, um, but yeah, those are macros. We're gonna get to that uh, after loadouts. Thermal, okay, watch. So, you see this? Um, this thermal. So, you know, you can make out stuff like this, this, this. Oh, yeah, this is a great example because I tried to record. Okay, this is off topic, but I tried to record. For the first time, this is the second time recording. Uh, my mic did not record, so have to do it again, obviously. And I suck at voiceovers, so yeah. Um, but yeah, I suck at voiceovers. So then go to graphics. If you turn this off, apply changes. Oh geez, no, no, not that. You can't really make out like the shadows of the building. But okay, can I? I need. I will need a new keyboard. But get back on topic. Uh, apply. Yes. See how I can make uh out those objects shaping like the AC right there, the stairs. Yeah, that's why um having your ambient occlusion on high would be really good. But yeah, um. Brand settings, don't mess with these because uh, it will affect your performance. I know this one gives you FPS boost, but you know, we need everything like as crisp as possible so you can see your enemies. I don't know why I sound like I'm talking about this like it's a BO3 or some shit, but yeah, but yeah, have this all off. Don't even mess with these. Um, I didn't mess with that, I didn't mess with that. Voice chat enabled off. Like, who who the fuck uses voice chat now? On PC. But yeah, never mess with that. Never mess with that. And. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, let me take off my thermal. Uh, but yeah, next up, loadouts. Okay, so now we're talking about loadouts. Um, let's start off with the pistols. Uh, heavy revolver. Um, really good gun. Uh, uh, I'll teach you guys how to how to do the revolver spam glitch in another video. But for right now, I can't do it because I'm too lazy to get my controller. <laughs> but yeah, I'm too lazy to get my controller. And also, I don't know how to do it on PC, like with mouse and keyboard. I'm on mouse and keyboard right now. But yeah. Uh, so scenario. Uh, obviously, this is a good example. The night shark. 
Let's say a press is coming after you. You hide under a bridge. Pretend this this area. We're gonna go to the Devon Western the hangar. Right here. Is a bridge. You see a presser coming at you. Uh pretend Okay, I don't have I don't know why, but I have bulletproof windows on here. I need to take this off. But pretend I'm still in the car. Uh pretend that's in the presser, the yellow plane. Uh the heavy revolver comes into play. Really good, cause like if you're on mouse and keyboard, you shoot them out. You gotta time it though, but like, but like if you do it on console, it's like really hard. But like, if you time it, you'll be able to get someone easily. Uh, also, you know, BST. If you have BST, hit him one time. He's gonna fall off the oppressor because you know. BST is double health and double damage, so you could literally clap someone with that. But yeah, for your night shark, have all the windows off. I don't know why I have the windows on, but have all the windows off. Just don't have any bulletproof windows. Just have all of that off. Anyways, second thing. Um, okay. AP pistol. So, AP pistol. Only use this in spe uh, vehicle cargo or um. Yeah. All right. Only use this in vehicle cargo and um. Like any cargo in general. If you don't, if you can't destroy it, like that much, you can't like use a sticky bomb. You can't use like a sticky to destroy it. Cause like you know, vehicle cargo, you obviously need like your cargo to go to your warehouse, or else if you destroy it, it's gonna get like destroyed, and you gotta like get some other cargo but yeah that's where the ap pistol comes to play you kill the npc out of like your vehicle cargo and yeah it'll be just like minimal damage but yeah ap pistol really good weapon for like cargo and stuff but don't use it in free mode um where's atomizer okay atomizer uh i only use this weapon for fun but it checks out. You see how I spam with the atomizer? Yeah, because I have macros. Stupid, not playing. But like, but yeah, not. Uh, I'm playing. But um, yeah, the atomizer. Um, I still need to fix my macros. Well, we get that after this loadout thing, cause. My uh, quick switch like that is a uh, Q, and I'm not using to use. Uh, I'm not used to using used, bruh. But for real, I'm not using. I'm not used to using Q for uh, macros or like in CSGO in general. Cause like, okay, this is off topic, but in CSGO, I switch with my side button for a sniper. For my op, I switch with the side button. But yeah, I'm not used. I don't know how people do that. Like they use Q to switch through weapons. But yeah, um what's up next? Uh okay, combat MG. Obviously OP weapon with it will be more OP if you use BST and armor. And so all obviously you gotta know how to use it. <laughs> or else you're gonna get destroyed by somebody in a uh, an oppressor or have a, a like have a rocket launcher around the corner but yeah uh, free aim doesn't affect it that much with mouse and keyboard but an auto aim you really need to lower it down you can't actually like spray at the head you gotta literally lower it down because the recoil is a bit jumpy but like in first person it's like okay you don't notice it on PC like with mouse and keyboard but the recall in first person is like dead on accurate with the combat MG but yeah uh, that's all I have to say about that weapon special MK special carbine MK2 um, I guess this is okay this is used for RNG also free mode if you know how to use it and it's not like the combat MG where the recoil is like jumpy like this like hold up this but yeah you need to uh this for rng players mostly but you can use it in free mode if you know how to use it 
with BST and armor also, like also OP. Um, I don't have uh, you see, I only have special carbine MK2. I don't use advanced rifle for some reason. I don't like it. On PS4, I have the bullpup rifle with the blue middle jacket rounds. I think so. I can like um, I can uh, one shot people with a helmet at the head. Cause usually if you uh, have regular rounds and you're trying to shoot at the head, it takes three bullets to kill someone. Okay, so that's all I have to say about the rifles. Heavy sniper, obviously heavy snipers to go to, really easy. Okay, why didn't I switch? All right, but yeah. But yeah, heavy sniper is really good. One shot or two shot. One shot if you're laggy, two shot regular, regularly. But if someone's if you shoot someone, almost dead, just switch to marksman and then shoot at them. Uh, but yeah, this is a really good weapon. Don't need to explain it because you know, heavy, um, heavy sniper is a go. Also, I, I also I forgot to, to bruh. But for real, all right, for real. Uh, I know you guys are gonna be in the comments like, why use MK1? Use MK2. Well, MK1, I real, I personally, I feel like it's better because it's like light. I also use it on PS4 because it's like it's like doesn't lag my game because like, uh, consoles like really laggy. But yeah, I feel like this is light, like the MK1. Also, if you're laggy, more likely you get to one shot somebody. Unlike the MK2, uh, it takes it's like a little bit of a chance to one shot somebody. I don't know how to explain it, but yeah, um, marksman doesn't even need the exp explanation. Two OP with BST, cause literally it's a three shot. You could literally kill someone <laughs> instantly. <laughs> With a marksman because it's three shot, but yeah, um, nothing there to explain there too. Uh, pump shotgun, not really good on PC, obviously, because you know you don't got auto aim unless you're gonna troll someone and then just smack them with the pump shotgun with the MK2. Well, this is MK2, but if you're gonna smack someone with the shotgun with explosive slugs, that's OP. Recommend only using this in assisted aim because if you use it in free aim, not really good. That's what I'm just saying, not really good. In obviously common sense, you know why? Because it's like it's not an automatic rifle, but yeah, it's not an automatic rifle. So, you're gonna kill someone like that. You have to be really lucky to uh, kill someone with explosive shotgun. Or if you're skilled, but yeah, uh, heavy weapons. Okay, why did I switch? Jeez. Yeah, this is what I hate. I don't know, not hate, but like I don't know why that's happening. Cause, uh, but yeah, uh, okay. First up, homing launcher. It's good because it's faster than RPG. Like. You see how fast those rockets are going? Compare that to a... Yeah, you see how slow the RPG is going? Oh, I forgot to mention. RPG is not... Does not really reach long like a homing. Because uh, the homing has a longer range. But yeah, uh... I'll just give you a tip for homing and RPG. Because I really don't have anything to explain it with, to be honest. I don't know how to like really explain it in scenarios but this is one like tip use homing if you want a quick kill and use RPG if you want like a kek at BJW cuz or if you run out of rockets on your homing cuz homing has 10 rockets this has 20 but yeah a uh, grenade launcher self-explanatory only used if you want to kick someone at BJW or uh, kill someone on the other side of the building. Uh, don't. Well, you can use the, the compact grenade launcher on PC, but like, 
honestly, we yeah, yeah, but like I, I don't have a problem with that. But like uh, but like honestly, I would like stick to this. If you screw up on your grenade launcher spam on, if you're using like a controller or something, if you screw up your grenade launcher spam, use this. So like you don't screw up, cause compact grenade launcher like it's like, hold up. I think I have my compact grenade launcher. Let me just go to inventory. Okay, look, compact grenade launcher regularly. You gotta reload like that. But yeah, I could do the spam too. Pretty easy on PC, but yeah, let me. Let me switch to the RPG and disable weapon loadout. But yeah, grenade, grenade launcher like this. Like, if you screw up your spam, you just do that, and it's still like fast enough to kill someone. But yeah, uh, also if you use the grenade launcher, launcher, and then you take cover, you could literally spam. Like literally, it's faster than this yeah it's faster than that I mean I screwed up on that one spam but like still it's faster than that so uh, yeah um next thing sticky bombs self-explanatory if you have a rifle someone's at the other side of the wall throw it I forgot how to throw on PC but throw it and then detonate it you could get the kill pretty easy pretty self-explanatory and also since EO is out, because Rockstar removed it, bam. Alright, but yeah. Uh, so yeah, that's it for little weapon loadout. Let's just go to macros. Alright, okay, so macros. Still need to fix, but yeah. These are my macros. Evo 1, Beast Team Numpad 0, Armor Key F5, RPG Ammo Key F3, CO Start, Num Dot, CO Ghost, Numpad 3, Passive Evo F7, Rapid Sniper, Left Alt, MC CO, Numpad Multiply, CO MC, Multiply the Vibe. Um, RPG Reload is my, my side button. So like I spam faster, uh, orc top. Uh, I forgot what these are called. Oh, these are for, but yeah. Uh, atomizer is Q. Um, thermal helmet number nine, which obviously you saw in the, earlier in the video. I went to thermal helmet, activated it really quick. But yeah, I'll leave this down in the description below if you guys want to see my macros. Uh, but yeah, I'll just show you some some things real quick. So, oh geez, I almost got kicked out. What the fuck? But like, yeah. Um, okay, so I'm running a CEO. This grab your CEO. Not grab your. Why did it say grab your CEO? Uh, grab your BST. Grab your armor. That self-explanatory. That's why you have macros, cause you could reload easier and shit. Hold up. Okay, uh, that did not work. Okay, see? You saw that? That's how you get your ammo faster. Oh yeah, my uh spam. Please don't bully me because uh, I haven't played in two weeks. I've been on Rainbow, but yeah. Anyways, hope these guys help you, I guess, on PC. I'll do a console video in a little bit, and yeah, see ya.